Hi family and welcome to my video. Today I'm going to try this foundation camouflage effect from Catrice All Matte. Okay, so this is not a new foundation. It's been out there for a long time, but this just arrived to Sweden and Catrice wasn't really available here. Uh, right now it is and I'm very excited about it. I love Catrice foundations and the one that I can't live without is actually the HD liquid coverage. This is my second package. I love this foundation. I'm never going to get be without but actually I use number 30 in this um, in this foundation and actually it uh, works it's maybe just a shade or two darker but it is what I prefer this foundation was uh, available in a couple of shades and the closest to this one was number 20 so I am going to go nude beige I hope it will match me I already primed my face with milk hydro primer and let's go. I'm going to use a beauty blender and I'm actually in a hurry. So I'm going to hurry up. It's 12.15 at all 12.14 and um, I'm going to wear this foundation the whole day. Oh, let's let's put it on my hand. Oh, it's a nice pump. The shade looks to be quite nice. Let's see. I hope it will be similar to the, sh the other foundation that I have matte because I do have oily t-zone and I get very shiny during the day and I need to have foundation now that will stay on at least for 12 hours and not look cakey of course or oily so Ooh, this feels like nothing <laughs> like air the shade looks nice I'll definitely get full more coverage with the sponge, I know that, but I'm going to use my sp sponge, or with brush. Did I say sponge? I don't know. Because if you use a sponge, you'll get less coverage than with a brush. But I don't have a clean brush and I don't feel like I want to try with the brush right now because I'm in a hurry. Uh, one coat, and this looks nice. The shade looks very, very nice. So I'm just going to go all over the face. Okay. I really like how this looks right now. It looks like I don't have makeup on at all. It looks pretty good. I don't know why people don't talk about it as much. Everybody's so excited about new products. They forgot the old product actually works and should continue to be loved and used. I really like Catrice products. Let's bring it down here a little bit. I think the shade is very nice. I do have different tones on my neck and on my face and on my body. So to find a really good match, it's almost impossible for me. So oh, I like this a lot. It gives me medium to full coverage. It's not the fullest. And I don't feel like I actually want to build it up anymore. Uh, I feel like this is enough. It gives me a very natural look and uh, I like that. I'm very happy how it sits on my skin. It actually sank into my skin and feels like nothing. It feels like air. So far, this is, <laughs> this is really good. Matte shine control makeup lasts up to 18 hours, mattifying oil free. Long wearing shine control makeup with light reflection pigments for a sat satin matte and even complexion. I like that. It sounds amazing, really. And I'm going to use my Makeup Revolution concealer. I'm almost out. It's one of the best concealers. Sorry, guys, but I know there are so many good concealers, but actually I always go back to this one. Oh, I love my face right now. It looks so nice and even. Not too full coverage so that it look unnatural. Uh, but it's it covered everything I wanted to be, cover. And still leave my skin shine through a little bit. So it's very medium coverage. I can definitely build it up if I want full coverage. But I really don't feel like I want to. I'm going to set my under eyes with the Shiseido powder. I really like how it sits uh, under my eyes, this powder. 
and also fills in the pores so they disappear. I like that. But I'm on rest of my face. I'm going to go with another powder. I bought the um, Hourglass Veal Powder and I've been using it a couple of days. I really, really like it. So I'm going to set the rest of my face with that. But before I do so, I do want to go in with the cream bronzer. This is from Larizzi. And I got it in my, one of my subscription boxes and I've been loving it, loving it. It's also very close to the Huda Beauty Tentor, but this is more like a bronzy shade. And I like that. Just like a base for my bronzer. It blends into nothing. Uh, it blends very nice. I wanted to say into nothing. Of course, it blends to something, but it doesn't leave streaks or look unnatural. Everything looks so nice and smooth. Really, really like the foundation. Everything blends without a problem. I'm going to set my bronzer with the Hourglass bronzer. No. Yes, Hourglass bronzer. I'm going to use that. I wanted to do the another one, but I'm so into this one again. And I feel like this gives me very... It's a similar tone. Let's take it down a little bit. I love how my skin looks right now. It's very healthy. I'm going to go off camera and not actually off camera, but I'm going to film another makeup tutorial right now. So when I do that, I'll be back to show the final results. Okay, guys. So let's see. Right now it's 12.34 and I've been having this foundation on for 50 minutes. I had a uh, film this very fast, make, fa fast makeup look. God, I talk. My God, I can't talk today. What's wrong with me? Okay, I really like how my skin looks. It looks perfect. It looks like I don't don't have a foundation on. And if it's the case that this holds the whole day without looking cakey, I promise I will buy two more packages. I need to buy more before it's before it disappears and it's sold out because I won't be able to live without without this foundation. It's look looks amazing i need to run and fix my hair guys but i'll be back in a couple of hours to tell you what i think bye so guys this is the first makeup look a little bit smoky hi my family and welcome back now it's around or exactly 8 15 or 16 and i'll be having all this makeup for eight hours exactly I just hit my head in the bed, in the corner of the bed. It hurts. It's going to leave a mark. <laughs> okay, so um, I have foundation, that, not foundation, but mascara that transformed down here. Sorry, I didn't turn on, on my lights that I have on the side, but I hope you can still see my makeup. Now, let me come closer. Uh, I do have a dark under my eyes because of the foundation not the foundation I'm saying foundation again because of the mascara and also because of the um, eyeshadow but I do look a little bit shiny not shiny but healthy glow and I'll be touching my face a lot today uh, this afternoon having very so much fun but I actually really like how this foundation looks looks on my face it uh, doesn't feel on my skin I don't feel oily. I don't feel like it's breaking apart. It looks very nice. I've been touching my face, like I said, so many times today, and I really like this foundation a lot. My bronzer, my blush, everything is still on, on like it was before. Let's just maybe first take off the shine just a little bit, and yeah. I love it. I love this foundation. This is a very good foundation. And my nose looks very nice. I like that. I'm surprised. Uh, Catrice does some amazing foundation and it's uh, definitely my favorite. Uh, this one is my new favorite. Very nice. If you haven't tried this, I know if you like this, this is so good. I love this foundation, but this one is... I, know, I think I like it just a little bit more. 
uh, and this 20 looks very nice on me right now it's perfect shade so very happy um, I like it I like it love this foundation it's a little bit thicker than this one uh, but it gives me the same results also sinks into the skin beautifully I think this one keeps me more mad than the other one but I really really enjoy and I think it's, I think it's long lasting and I think actually it would definitely stay like this for a couple of more hours um, but yeah I'm very surprised I really like this foundation guys I want uh, I know this is nothing new but if you know you have this uh, if you know you have easy access to this foundation and you haven't tried it and or you tried it a couple of years ago and I uh, don't remember what you think about it or if you forgot about this foundation check it out I mean it's worth the money it's not expensive and it's very nice results so I really enjoy this foundation definitely going to purchase some more but guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and I hope I see you in my next video I love you all bye